chapter 13 verse 10 John chapter 13 verse 10 the Bible says Jesus said to him he that is watch needeth not save to wash his feet but is clean every whit and he are clean but not whole close your eyes Say this prayer upon loud and clear. Say, let the rain from heaven wash away my sin and its negative symptoms. In the name of Jesus, let the rain from heaven wash away my sins and its negative symptoms. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. You're welcome to Evangelist Joshua TV, a TV channel dedicated for dreams interpretation and warfare prayers. I'm Evangelist Joshua, broadcasting from Lagos, Nigeria. Today's topic is 20 minutes of bathing in the dream. 20 minutes of bathing in the dream. Perhaps you have been seeing yourself bathing in the dream, you have been bathing in the dream, or you are seeing your children bathing in the dream, or you are bathing naked, bathing in the public. You now, as you are bathing, somebody is peeping at you. What are the spiritual meaning of a Christian? Baffing in the dream. Baffing in the dream, especially your emotion behind that dream. By the grace of God, we are going to tell you the spiritual meaning of beating. What does it connote? Praise the living Jesus. Baffing in the dream can represent both good and bad symbols. Baffing takes the process of washing the body. Biblically, Buffing refers to purifying, cleansing, and releasing ourselves from sin or from the battles of life. Buffing in dream involves around spiritual growth. If you are walking in the path of sin, buffing in the dream represents deliverance from sin, represents salvation, represents a time of restitution or a time of new beginning. We'll be looking at the 20 minutes of bathing in the dream. 20 minutes of bathing in the dream. Number one, bathing in the dream represents brokenness. It represents brokenness. That is, it's time for you to be broken as a Christian. Bathing in the dream means brokenness. Praise the living Jesus. Number two meaning of bathing in the dream is bathing in the dream represents purification. And cleansing. Buffing in the dream represents purification and cleansing. It's time for you to purify yourself. It's time for you to cleanse yourself. It's time for you to repent of your sins. That is buffing in the dream. Purify yourself. Stay away from any un 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 unholy things, unclean things. That's buffing in the dream. Number three minutes is buffing in the dream represents new birth or new beginning new birth or new beginning that is when you are buffing yourself in a dream it means an approaching new birth an approaching new beginning is about to erupt in your life because when you are buffing definitely all the sins all the unclean things all the spirit that torment you the troubles of life you are buffing them away we are washing them away what happens in new birth a new beginning so the bible says all things are passed away behold all things have become new. So, the buffing in that dream represents new birth, new beginning. So, it's time for you to separate yourself from that old way of life, that old habit. Praise the living Jesus. Number four, buffing in the dream represents salvation. You need to be saved. You need to be saved. If you have not yet given your life to Christ, the buffing in the dream is flashing that light to you that you need to repent of your sins. You need to surrender all to Jesus Christ. Buffing in the dream tells you that you need, you need God's presence in your life. Number five, especially when you wake up feeling bad about this buffing in the dream, it represents temptation. Temptation. So it is a warning for you to be very conscious that temptation is coming. So when you are seeing other people buffing the dream, it represents temptation. So temptation is coming and find ways to resist that temptation as a child of God. Number six, buffing the dream represents shame and disgrace. Shame and disgrace. When you are buffing yourself outside, when you are buffing yourself naked, 
people are watching you while, while bathing in the dream, it represents shame and disgrace. Shame in marriage, disgrace at workplace and all that. So you need to pray. Father, every power that want, that want to ridicule me, that want to put me to shame, scatter their plans in Jesus' name. Number seven, number seven, bathing in the dream represents deliverance. Deliverance. It's time for you to go for deliverance. You are bathing in the dream. It is telling you that it's time for you to go for deliverance. Go for deliverance. God is about to settle your case through that deliverance. Kindly look. Go for deliverance. That's Mountain of Fire and Miracle Ministries on any Bible-believing church and conduct your deliverance in that church. Praise the name of Jesus. Number eight. Bathing in the dream represents sanctification. Sanctification. Your soul, your body, your spirit need to be sanctified. So it's telling you that you need to sanctify your body, your soul, your spirit need to be cleansed, need to be purified, need to be dedicated, need to be surrendered to Jesus Christ. That is bathing in the dream. Praise the living Jesus. Number nine, bathing in the dream represent baptism. Represent baptism. Bathing in the dream represent baptism. If not yet, if you are not yet baptized by water is the time for you to get yourself baptized you need to baptize yourself you need to baptize yourself let every dead sin let every sin in your life dead become dead and let jesus christ resurrect you into his resurrect you as his own children praise the living jesus if you are seeing yourself bathing in the dream it tells you that you need to rededicate your life to christ and you need to get baptized get baptized get baptized and the Lord will give you that power to deal with that sin that is corrupting your life in Jesus' name. Number 10, bathing in the dream represents getting rid of problems. Getting rid of problems. You are getting rid of that problems tormenting your life. Number 11, bathing in the dream represents repentance, as I've said, purification, sanctification, cleansing, repentance. Bathing in the dream represents repentance. Repent from your sin, repent from every known sin. Repent for any sin that you have committed and confess your sin. Praise the living Jesus. Bathing in the dream represents mercy and forgiveness. Mercy and forgiveness. You need to cry out for God. Cry out to God for mercy and forgiveness. You need divine mercy. You need divine forgiveness. Let God forgive you of your past sin. Praise the living Jesus. Number 13. Bathing in the dream represents peace, comfort, and joy. Peace comfort and joy you will have that joy you will have that peace you will have that comfort as a result of that bathing in the dream so when you are having that thing be very rest assured that the peace of the lord will reign in your life be very rest assured that god will give you good comfort be very rest assured that god will give you that joy you desire in jesus name we pray amen number 14 bathing in the dream represent good health good health Bathing in the dream represent good health. Number 15, bathing in the dream represent power, fame, and authority. You are gaining more power, fame, and authority. That is bathing in the dream. Because when you are bathing, you gain the most spiritual strength. You will get that authority and you will be famous. Because those things that you think that it is tarnishing your image, destroying your image, they are being washed away. So all these things will make you more glorious, more popular, more powerful, are having authority over the works of darkness. Number 16, Buffy in the dream represent healing from illness. Healing from illness. When you are having that kind of dream, knows that the Lord is about to heal you from that present illness, from that present sickness, or the one that is coming in the future. God is about to heal you from that sickness. Praise the living Jesus. Number 17, Buffy in the dream Buffing in the dream represents protection from evil. Protection from evil. When you are buffing yourself in the dream, know that the Lord is trying to protect you from evil. External threat, external attack. The Lord is about to protect you. And the Lord is about to save you from danger. Praise the living Jesus. Number 18, buffing in the dream represents transformation. You'll be transformed as a new bet. You'll be transformed. You'll be transformed in your spirit. And you will have more, you gain more power and having more closeness with God. Praise the living Jesus. Number 19, bathing in the dream may also represent spiritual problems. That is, someone is having spiritual problems. 
So, especially on the negative side, spiritual problems. You wake up from that dream and the ending or the, the, the process of that dream seems so, so scary. So it means that you're having spiritual problems. So you need to go for deliverance. Lastly, number 20, buffet in the dream represents removal of old garment. Removal of old garment. You are removing that old garment from your life. That is buffing in the dream because you are watching your watching your body. You are removing that old garment that people are seeing to judge you falsely. So you are removing that old garment. You are putting on new garment upon your life. The garment of honor, the garment of respect, the garment of new beginning, the garment of joy and peace. May that be your portion in Jesus' name. And may the Lord favor you in everywhere you go in Jesus' name. So what are the way out? Number one. What are the way out? Number one. Give your life to Christ. Two. Repent from every known sin. Three. Build a good relationship with God. Four. Ask God for mercy and forgiveness. Five. Break, a, break any curse, covenant, or dedication affecting your life. Six. Send the arrows of shame and disgrace back to sender. Seven. Deliver yourself from spiritual problems. Eight. Pray for the recovery of your lost virtues. Nine, live a holy life. Live a holy life at all times. Ten, fight against any person revealing your nakedness to the world. Eleven, keep every secret thing to yourself. Instruction and back on seven days fasting and prayers from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. Decree Psalm 51, Psalm 51, verse 2, into the water and use it to beat yourself for seven days. Command the Lord. To wash away every spiritual and physical problem from your life. Close your eyes. Take this prayer point. Say, every spiritual water attacking my glory, dry up by fire in the name of Jesus. Every spiritual water attacking my glory, dry up in Jesus' name. Say, Oh Lord, arise and cover my nakedness from my enemies. Oh Lord, arise and cover my nakedness from my enemies in Jesus' name. Say, every problem that came into my life, I washed them away. Every problem that came into my life, I wash them away in Jesus' name. So you dirty water from the spiritual world affecting my progress, dry up in Jesus' name. Say, so, oh God, deliver me from public embarrassment. Deliver me from public embarrassment in Jesus' name. Say, so, any spiritual bit that has been done against me to bring problems into my life, die in Jesus' name. Die in Jesus' name. Die in Jesus' name. Say, so, my destiny reject the evil consequences of spiritual bits upon my life. My destiny reject the evil consequences of spiritual bits upon my life. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So I'm very sure that you are blessed by this spiritual meaning of baiting. I pray that the Lord will wash away your sin. The Lord will take away that problem that is troubling your life. There shall be a new beginning in your life. There shall be peace. There shall be transformation in your life in Jesus' name. If this book has blessed you, share it to your friends and family. Once again, this is Evangelist Joshua from Levers.